Hey everybody, so I'm here with Plan With Me in my vertical and chondrant, and this week I'm going to be using a kit by Formless Designs again, and I checked all the cut lines on this one and it seems to be okay. So I'm going to go ahead and decorate it. And uh, this week is my sister's birthday. It's on Tuesday. And even though we don't live in the same state currently, um, I still thought it would be nice to decorate my planner in a birthday theme. But, I mean, also, to be honest, I didn't want to wait to, to use this kit. This is, like, really pretty. <clears throat> also, sorry if I, like, clear my throat a lot. Um, I'm having, like, I don't know what it is. I've been having some, like, really bad issues with my allergies lately. And, um, <clears throat> yeah, I don't know. So I have, I have a, um, just a little explanation, I guess. I have a rabbit, and, um, it, if you've ever had a rabbit before, then you know that they require hay. They have to eat hay. And, um, shortly after we got our rabbit, I started having, um, issues like, um, I started having allergy symptoms, which is weird because I had never had allergies before in my life. I'd had, um, like, seasonal allergies, but they were never, really, like, really bad and they didn't last that long. And, yeah, so I, I mean, I don't really consider myself ever having had a big issue with it before. But how do I want to do these colors? I think I might do them in the opposite order. Because I kind of don't want a ton of this darker blue. So, I'll do the opposite. Oh, okay. Ooh. So, yeah, but shortly after we got our rabbit, I started noticing I was having a lot of allergy symptoms. What am I doing? I need a header, girl. Uh-uh. See, look, I can't even think straight. Okay. Where? There's glitter headers in here. There we go. Okay, let me just let me figure this out because these are not in the same order. Okay. Um, yeah, so I started having allergy symptoms and I went to the doctor and I, I was having them for, I don't know, a few weeks probably before I decided to actually go to the doctor before I realized it just wasn't going away. Um, and I was tested for allergies and found out that I am allergic to pretty much every single grass and hay that there is. And then, um, but especially Timothy and alfalfa hay, which is the, the, those are the two types of hay that um, you'll typically find at the store for, like, um, for rabbits. So, yay me. So now I, uh, not only cannot feed my rabbit her hay to have my husband do it, but <clears throat> now uh, just having her in the house is causing my allergies to go crazy. I feel like my allergies have gotten worse in the last few weeks. They've just been like absolutely insane and triggering asthma attacks and just like out of nowhere. I don't know. It's ridiculous. I don't know what is going on. It's just weird though because nothing has changed. It's just just start freaking out. I don't know why. If anybody has any, like, ideas on what could be going on, like, I'm all ears. And, um, my allergy medicine, I've noticed, has stopped being as effective. Um, I'm taking Zyrtec, which is what was prescribed to me by my doctor, and then um, I've taken Claritin before, and that didn't really do much for me, uh, and my doctor prescribed another one that I was taking, and then that one seemed to be working, but then I lost it, and I don't remember what it's called, so that sucks. So yeah, I don't really... <clears throat> 
and know what I'm supposed to do about that. And now I have like, I don't know if I, see it, it's gotten so bad that now I think I have a cold, but I honestly can't tell if it's a cold or if it's just allergies because I have a stuffy nose. Like you can probably hear I sound very nasally. I have a stuffy nose, but I don't feel sick. Like I don't feel like I have a cold. Usually when I feel, when I have a cold, I can feel like, I can feel that I'm sick. I feel like germy and my throat feels like warm and gross. Um, that's probably TMI, but I'm sure you guys all know what I'm talking about. But yeah, and I don't feel any of that. I just feel like my nose is stuffed and it's obnoxious. And I use one of those like little Vicks like smelly stick things I used it before bed last night and I must have gotten some of it on my skin or like the vapors were too strong it like the skin under my nose it burned my skin it was so bad that I was trying to like fall asleep and like tough it out but I had to get up and wash my face and that was insane I don't know what happened with that it was crazy but yeah, I mean, it's just, it's been a wild ride, you guys. Wild, allergy-filled ride. Um, and I'm also allergic to, when my doctor told me over the phone, like, she called me and told me the results of my allergy test, it was kind of hard to hear her, um, uh, during the last part of what she said. And the last thing that she said was, she said, I'm allergic to dust, but I'm not sure if she said, like, I'm allergic to dust or, like, dust mites. I don't know. I don't know if there's a difference, but I'm allergic to something having to do with dust. And I've definitely noticed that, but I don't know. I don't know what's going on. And I've changed my air filter, like, a bazillion times. And... They just keep getting worse, and I don't want to go back to the doctor. I hate going to the doctor. It always seems like such a waste of time. Anywho, I'm going to do a no white space spread this week. I'm sure you guys could probably tell that already. Yeah, see, I like that better. I don't really, uh, I'm not a fan of the dark blue. I wish that this kit had the light blue. I feel like that's pretty, like, random. Like, nothing else has, like, that... Like, there's dark blue in it, but nothing else has, like, that much dark blue. I don't know. I think that's a weird color choice, but it's not a big deal. Where's my little things? Do I have little things in here? Oh, no, these ones don't have little things. I need those little labels. <clears throat> okay. Now, I'll put down some labels for food, for meals. And, let's see, I don't think I have any weak, I'm not a big fan of the, the setup of, like, the format of these kits, but I have so many of them, you guys, like, I just need to use them up, I can make it work, okay, and I don't have any, you know what I need to do, I just need to make some, like, multicolor weekly ombres because it always frustrates me when I can't <clears throat> like I don't have any in the kit that I'm using so I just need to make some solve my problem and then I don't know if see since I don't have any weekly ombres and there's none that come in the kit I don't know if I want to put like a second label down because I want to track my dinners down here and my son's dinners and sometimes they're the same but most of the time they're different so I don't know or I don't know if I should even bother tracking mine at all and just track his I don't know I don't know I, don't know. I think I'm just gonna do his okay yeah that's fine I don't think I want to put anything else let's see I have my thing here 
okay. I think that's the only thing I'm gonna put for like the little things. And I'll put some more glitter headers on top of that. So I'm kind of regretting getting the rose gold on the coil because to be perfectly honest, it looks... I don't know it doesn't look very I guess it looks I guess it does when you put it up next to gold it looks rose gold but by it like when you're just looking at it by itself it looks more coppery you can, I don't even think you can tell on camera that it's rose gold but I don't know it was a $10 upgrade you guys $10 to upgrade the color of the coil which I think is stupid but I don't know I did it just because I hadn't done it the last time and I wanted to see how it looked and honestly not worth it I think because I, I got the rose gold because I thought the rose gold would look cute with this cover and it does but silver would have looked just fine too I really don't think that upgrading the coil is worth ten dollars I think that's stupid I don't even think these planners are worth the what, 50 dollars $55 that, that you pay for them. Like, I mean, yeah, they're nice, but really, there's not that much to them. Like, I don't know if this bothers anybody else, but has it bothered anyone else that the the paper in this Erin Condren, I don't know if it's just like the new ones, but the paper is like an off-white. Like, look, can you tell? I don't even know if you can tell on camera, but it's like an off-white. And it bothers me, I don't know why. I don't know why it bothers me, but it really does. I mean, I cover most of it, most of it up anyway, so it doesn't really matter that much, but I don't know. I guess I'm just in a complaining mood. Okay, what box do I want to put here? I think I want to put the... Eh, but then that's right next to the pink. Uh, I think I want to put... No, I kind of want to save that one for the dark blue. I think I'm going to put this box. And then I think... I don't know. I don't have um, the flags in this are not big enough to cover these flags. So like, I don't know if I just want to leave it or if I want to like cover it like that or it'll be like a double. It looks super weird because these, I don't know, these flags aren't very like, they're not as pointy is the flags in here but then this color doesn't look that bad with it so I think that'll look better than doing that that'll just look weird yeah I'm not gonna do that okay uh, go ahead and <clears throat> put my full boxes in I'm just gonna stagger them like I have been I'm gonna put the Actually, I'm going to use the cake. Oh, I don't know. I wanted to use the cake on this one. I'm going to use it on this one. I don't care. I think I usually start at the top for the Monday one, but I'm going to start at the bottom. I think I'm going to put the... Oh, okay. So the cut lines on this kit are fine, but the actual cuts are a little iffy. Okay. I'm going to put the puppy and the kitty down here. Okay. And then I think I'm going to put 
presents on this day. the only headers I think these are the only headers that are on here I'm gonna take a to-do put it on the side and I'll put the last heart checklist here and that kind of brings blue to this side a bit okay the rest of my full boxes. <clears throat> Put this one up here. I definitely want to put this one over here. Well, thing I will say about this Erin Condren paper though is that the stickers come up from it a lot nicer than they did on the last like paper from what I remember. I think I'm going to save the martini and put it on the other side. save the martini because I don't really have a spot over here that I really want to put it. Uh, I'm, just, I'm gonna throw it on the side real quick. I'm gonna put a glitter in there first. I might as well use a blue one. Monday I need to remember to weigh myself so I'll put a little appointment label for that and uh, what well, there's no washi in this one was there any washi in the last one I don't even remember yeah there was no maybe there wasn't maybe I just used the headers okay I guess that's what I'll do. Ooh. Oh, okay. Well, that, that explains that. The backing came off with this. There we go. Uh, and, whoa. Crooked. Oh, yeah, that comes up really nicely. One of these half boxes will fit in here very well. I don't have any plan for this one, but. Ooh, there's a little bit of a border, but I'll survive. Okay. Uh, and on this day is my sister's birthday. So I'm going to use one of these half boxes and. I'm going to stick an appointment label, just because I'm sure I can find something to use it for. And, yeah, I need another, another glitter header. There we go. 
And then I have to do groceries on Wednesday. So I'll put this appointment label for that. here for a half box. Ooh. There we go. Okay. Um, blue glitter. a little appointment label that I can stick down here. Honestly, like, let me see, what do I even have on Thursday? Uh, just trash day, so I guess that's what the appointment label will be for. And there. And I will use a half box. And then what I think I'm going to start doing is keeping the leftovers of the kit that I'm using in a certain week um, back here in this little folder. Or maybe I'll stick the pouch in here. Maybe that'll be better. Yeah, that'll probably be better. I'll actually get use out of the pouch. Um, so that throughout the week if I need anything I can grab a label or something that coordinates. So... That should work. Okay. Uh, I don't have any more appointment labels, but I can put... Yeah, the cuts on this are not great. Kind of a gamble. Okay. Put this up here. Glitter header. Eh. I don't have any more left for the other two colors. So this should be interesting. Uh, I guess I'll put another. have rounded corners but the rounding is so minimal that they're basically squared okay um And I kind of hate that I haven't been able to use these half boxes very much. But 
I will have them in case I need them. And of course, there's no weekend banner. Okay, let's see. Let's put the dates on. On Friday, the Planner Society is opening up their subscription slots, so I'm going to try and get one of those. Exciting. Let me finish up my sidebar real quick. I have two pieces of glitter header left. And... See, is there any deco? It's a happy birthday. I'll put that right here on this half box. And I'll put the kitty. The little birthday kitty right there. Let's see. Celebrate. Put that up at the top right there. I like this one has a lot of small deco. And like the last one that I used, it kind of had like just a lot of big stuff. Put one of these girls right here. I'm gonna put one of the larger girls. Put the blonde one here. Cute. I think that's all I'm gonna put. I don't want to get too crazy with it. Uh, let's see. I'm gonna go ahead and put these meal things on here. And I'll put the little. credit card next to one of these things for the planner society and I have groceries on Wednesday so I'll put the grocery thing there and I think that's gonna be it all right so we there is the final spread. It's really cute. I like it. I'm definitely glad that I only did one um, blue column and then just a very small amount here on the side. I think that looks good. All right. Kind of don't like that these aren't covered, but I'll survive. Anyway, uh, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. 
Uh, go ahead and give this video a thumbs up if you did. Subscribe if you haven't already, and I will see you in my next video. Bye!